Taurus. Taurus, I just do not know which deck to use for you today. This is kind of making me a little nuts. I've got so many decks here. I'm kind of a collector of them. I think there's so many new and interesting ones. I really like them. Uh, let's just get started. I want to see what's going on in your current energy. Five of Cups. Five of Cups. Ooh. What is going on, Taurus? Five of Cups. What are you regretting? You're regretting walking away from somebody for being cold. Walking away from somebody that you thought was this Queen of Wands. Hoo -hoo -hoo. Alrighty then. That come out nice and simple. What is Taurus's desire? Alright, we'll take that one. The Hierophant. Hello. Your own energy. Very nice. Six of Wands. The Empress. And the Tower. The Hierophant. That's the Hierophant. Your energy. The Empress. Your energy. Six of Wands. Yeah. This is very, very powerful. Very powerful. Because this is you clarifying your your this is yeah this is your energy clarifying your energy six of wands is about victory and success and i see the tower is breaking the walls down i see the tower as this monolith that's holding you back and you just like you know what let's do this let's crush it uh for some of you you've <sighs> You're, you're still successful in walling out somebody that you wanted to be with, that you probably still want to be with. Maybe that is why you want to break this tower down. You want that, that forever after. What is the outcome for Taurus? Queen of Cups. The Moon. Six of Pentacles. And the High Priestess. Okay. Uh, ooh. Oh, my God. Taurus, get a headache, Spotch? Oh, right in the left side. Sorry. This is hurting. This is hurting. Uh, Queen of Cups. Uh, this can be a lot of emotions. This can be love. The Moon, Piscean Energy. Six of Pentacles. Reciprocity. Gifts coming in. Uh, and the High Priestess. We see that it's possibly somebody that's wanting to come back to some degree. You're not certain, but there's love here in a major way. This person with the High Priestess here I see as being younger, possibly. Or for some of you, you're looking for somebody that, or the outcome is you're going to find somebody to fall in love with. Who, you're not sure, but trust that it will be reciprocated. What is working for you? The lovers. Hello. Three of Cups. Hello. The Emperor. Okay. We have the Hierof We have the Hierophant. We have the Empress. We have the Emperor. The Three of Cups. The Lovers. This is Divine Connection. Um, so what's working for you is love. There's almost like there's hope here. That there's ambition, but you're guarded against it. It seems very positive. Like this seems to flow together towards what's coming in. But it almost feels like there could be, with the Three of Cups, a reunion coming back together. Um, somebody may be a little guarded, but 
there's this action being taken. But what you need to be aware of is the magician. The queen of, queen of swords, king of swords, sun. Two of wands. Somebody's manifesting this connection again. Although they may seem guarded, a little unsure, somebody's trying to manifest oh, this connection. Interesting. Very interesting. Let's pull three more for guidance. The Nine of Swords, the Two of Pentacles, and the Page of Cups. This could be you, this could be them, but there's a lot of thinking going on here of how to balance the situation, how to go forward with it, and how to create that opportunity where it can again reemerge even just for a second. Wow. This is amazing. Well, all right, we have this. This is, that's part of your reading. I'm going to do something that I don't normally do. Let's grab some other cards. Let's see what it has to say. Let's see what your person is thinking, Taurus. What is Taurus's person thinking about Taurus? What is Taurus's person thinking about them? Okay, that was weird. Right in the crotch. External validation. Their accept, receive, and change maker makes waves. Interesting. Maybe for some of that, for some of you, your partner is, or who this person is, is wanting to know that you still care. That they're wanting to know that you're still in love with them. Why? But they can also be paying attention to everybody else that's saying not to be there. We also have the change maker makes waves. And so they seem like they're healing. And then we have accept and receive. And this is about accepting love into their life. Interesting. I want to grab another deck. I want to grab another deck. Which one do I want to use? Okay. Sorry, I don't normally do this. This is a weird one for me today. I don't know what's going on. Like I said, I'm getting weird headaches from you guys. Maybe it's my own situation as I am a Taurus, but they're just, ah, just dingers. What's going on with Taurus's person, please? What's going on with Taurus's person? Three cards. Taurus's person. The Hermit, the Six of Swords, and the Wheel. Things are changing for them. They're wanting to go with the flow after going within so much. And the Moon card, Pisces. Because their emotions are getting the best of them. Uh, the Death card. Just try to pop out, so change. What does Taurus's person want to say to Taurus? What does Taurus's person want to say to Taurus? The Tower, the Fool, and the Seven of Pentacles. They realized that this was this was something very toxic. Maybe they realized some of their behaviors, uh, and they're ready to jump and take a leap of faith with you. Wow. Okay. Now I just got dizzy. This is really weird. I don't understand this. Because I'm picking up all these energies, like my, all of a sudden the room starts spinning, and it's not my, it's not a blood sugar issue. Maybe your head's spinning, Taurus, just like mine is. I don't know. 
what is Taurus's person's next action going to be? Ten of Cups, the Sun card, Queen of Cups. They want this with you. They really want this with you. What is the challenge for Taurus's person? Temperance, Ace of Cups, Judgment, and the Page of Swords. How to bring this back around. They're stuck in their head of how to bring this back around. They might be spying on you with the, the Page of Swords here. They might be looking into the different things that you're doing. Um, this is really interesting, Taurus, because I'm picking up a lot of sensations right now. Like the one that I am getting is... Um, like almost nausea after crying, the right between my eyes. So maybe your person, maybe it's you, has been really stressed out. There's a lot of upset in their stomach uh, and in their head. It's almost like a crying headache. Um, so yeah, they really miss you. They're trying to figure out how to come forward. Or maybe they're waiting to, for you to come forward. Taurus, that's what I have for you today. I know, weird read. I don't normally do them. Uh, it's just kind of off the cuff. So that's what I have for you. Let me know what your thoughts are on this read. Give me a thumbs up or thumbs down if you like this read, if it resonates with you. We'll see you next time. Stay safe. And I hope this week is better than your last.